Hey everyone, so I just wanted to make a real quick video in this busy period just to touch base with all of you and wish you a happy end to 2022. With most of my attention directed towards my studies and clients recently, I haven't had a whole lot of time to make videos, but I have got a few good scripts written out and over the next few months you can expect to see at least three or four new videos. And I'm expecting every one of those videos to include some pretty good informative content and generally pack a punch. As of a few months ago, it has been three years since I started this channel and just look at the progress we have made together as a community. I think a more fluid understanding of type through a series of networks and gateways and cognitive continuums is becoming increasingly popular, which really does warm my heart to see. The emphasis of CPT has always been about putting the growth back into type and understanding type as something more transcontextual than static and discrete. Even the realm of personality science itself is beginning to move away from a few broad categories of traits, rather than assuming a trait such as extroversion will be the same across every single context. Traits such as this are now being seen as much more contextual in nature. Whether or not a person is extroverted depends upon their surrounding circumstances, which are all the while interacting with their core personality. And honestly, I think this is a beautiful way to look at things. And I think cognitive functions are no exception to this. Are you an extroverted thinker? Well, it depends upon what the situation necessitates. And this is what CPT is all about. It's about freeing up our mind so that we are able to adapt our cognition to the surrounding circumstances. We may always have a default kind of mode, a core type that even imbues every one of our dip functions with a sense of purpose stemming from a core cognition. But nonetheless, I'm excited to see all the things we're going to keep exploring as we delve into this interesting realm of cognitive fluidity. Behind the scenes, I'm actually starting to refer to cognitive types now as cognitive networks. And I've even been working on an expansion to CPT that I recently announced to my patrons that explores the degree to which we all jump networks outside of, say, INFJ for me into ESFJ. And there's actually a fairly neat but complex algorithm that explains why it's, for example, ESFJ and not ENFJ. And the next one or two CPT Explain videos will be covering this topic. And the whole purpose of this theoretical development was to explore the extent to which we change our gateways, not just accessing, say, extroverted thinking in my case through either a FE gateway or TI gateway, but actually having TE as a core gateway through, say, an ENFP position or even an ENTJ position. Fluidity is everywhere and I'm excited to keep exploring this with all of you. But that is it for the update. I hope all of you have a fantastic end to the year and I look forward to communicating with you again in 2023.